Well, she lasted 18 days in camp. In that time, she became a mother to the jungle emus and a wife to her jungle husband, Duncan Baratine. And uh, no doubt she'll uh, try to have a vengeance on us for making her drink those blended beach worms. Well, your votes mean it's time to leave, and here she is to tell us all about her jungle adventure. It's a bad feeling! <laughs> You're free! <laughs> You're free! <right. You're> <laughs> now, I don't think we've ever seen a celebrity to be as happy as you to leave that jungle. Oh my come God. on, have a seat. come on. Oh. Tell us all about it. Come and grab oh. a seat. Have a glass of champagne. Oh Buzz. my God! It's all yours. Fresh water, oh, not smoky you. water. Look, I'm going for the water first. Yeah. <laughs> Are you relieved? Very. Yeah. Very relieved. It's so hard. Yeah. People don't realize that it's it's really real and i stink and been living in the same underpants for years <laughs> and everything <laughs> everything smells and, and you're bitten to death yeah, and there's yeah. things in your bag at night and yeah. it's ugh. yeah it's real and it's hard work you're thrilled to be out aren't you oh, i can't, oh, wait, to see, can't Listen, wait to see my husband you faced quite a few trials and challenges as well mm. uh, let's remind ourselves here they are oh god <laughs> Celebrity, get me out of here. Oh, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't. I'm sorry. Yes. Cooking on gas. Blended tarantula. Yes! Oh! There was a lot of stuff in there. On the, now, the ghost train was, I think, the first big one you faced, and it didn't take you very long to shout, I'm a celebrity, get me out of here. I'm sorry. Yvette. But you know what? We were thrown in the deep end there, uh -huh. because I think that's really quite a horrendous thing to do first. Yeah. And I held my reserve for 10 minutes, and I actually, a blood was in, I was like, ah! And then it was just cockroaches everywhere, mm. and it was the smell. I'd never smelt them before. It and was you, grim. And during that, you had your knickers on your head. I, <laughs> do you know what? <laughs> Any girl needs to always, if you come in here, bring a yeah. big, sturdy pair of pants. OK, OK. And for the first couple of weeks, you were the one in camp who lifted everybody's spirits and kept Did the I? camp quiet. <laughs> well, for the first couple of weeks, not the past couple of days, the first couple of weeks. Have a look at this. Oh, God. Never mind, let's be positive. Good morning, yeah. good morning, good morning, good morning. I couldn't love Yvette anymore. No, okay. Darling, you're a sexy beast. Your hair is always okay. <laughs> six beans, anybody more six beans? Put it to six, seven, 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 seven. Five sheep. Five sheep, it's yours. <laughs> Yay. So you called Duncan your, um, uh, your jungle husband. Yes. And he was your jungle wife. Why was that then? Why did, why did you feel that? Well, because on the first night, uh -huh. I, was, I was really quite ill. And no one tells you that if you love tea and coffee, mm -hmm. and then you come in, you don't have any of that, yeah. you actually have this caffeine thing. And you get like a headache and stuff, don't oh, you? Oh, it was all, yeah. I felt so sick, and I was shaking, and I actually questioned myself a hundred times, what the hell am I doing in here? Mm -hmm. And I'm sat there shaking. And then I needed to go to the loo, and, and Duncan was so like, come on, I'll look after you. And he even wiped the wee off the seat. Did he? Wow. He wiped wow. the wee off the seat. An exclusive for you there, folks. <laughs> 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 um, so that was that was when you first went in there. You were very positive, but th in the last few days, we've noticed your your mood has taken a bit of a turn. You haven't been as bubbly as you were, and it seems that one particular lady is the cause of that, and it is at the centre of all of that. We want to show you this. Have oh, a look. Oh gosh! I'm just glad we I see the see true it. colors out of everyone right now before we get out of here. Lego, and do act you like. not think we've seen, seen oh, yeah. through you? Lady C, be quiet. Lady C, Lady C, shut, shut up. up. You are a rude, horrible woman at the moment, and I you've got a very, very, very nasty anything. energy about you. Be quiet. Don't even admit. Watch them. People think I'm not to be lied about. They never were. Noted. I mean, she's a sly silver fox, isn't she? Well, mm. actually, she's a sly silver witch. <laughs> <laughs> That's what she is. She's a very strange woman. I'm sorry, I've been polite towards the end yeah. because that's the only way you can be. Yes. But you never know. Everybody's walking on eggshells, so you actually never know when she's going to flip the switch. Um, and at the very beginning, I was very sort of for and thought she was brilliant and very, mm. very entertaining. But actually, she can be really cruel and get quite personal. So, you know, I hope I don't bump into her after we come out of here because I'll just be like, no. So you won't be joining her and Brian at this Chinese meal then? Absolutely not. No, 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 no. no way. And I suppose it's difficult when you're down there to, to work out how that goes down with the people that are watching. But mm. just so you know, the hashtag yes Yvette 
trended on Twitter. Did not. It did. Because <laughs> you stood up to her and you, and you, oh. and you shouted. Well, how do you feel about her now then? I mean, what, now that you're out, you still wouldn't want to meet know, up with her? I think she's it. vile. I'm sorry. Well, I think she's okay. not a very nice person. Okay. No. And she still seems to have a very big problem with, with Tony and Duncan. And that doesn't seem like it's, it's ever going to kind of cease that. No. I, I, Duncan and Tony cannot abide her. They're absolutely the same as me. And, um, you know, and she doesn't like them. But the weird thing is she, she always has to have the last word and she will never apologise for anything she's ever said. Mm -hmm. And I think it was when, uh, for Tony, it was when she was sort of making comments about his children that that was it then yeah, you know yeah, and for yeah. me it was it, she was making comments about my career and what I do and I think yeah. don't get personal you can have a disagreement yeah. but there's yeah. no need to Absolutely. yeah no, I get so it. that I get was it. our reason yeah. for it you know I've never known what it's like to live without a well-known name I would not actually say that I was famous uh, what I have is a modest degree of renown